I live in number 27 Baka Rifaro, Musavejo Amukoko, Lagos. I became, I joined this ministry in the year 2010. I want to thank God for making I and my family chosen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I am the young man that testified of how God connected me to a multi-million Naira company here in Lagos State. Hmm. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Uh, I happen to be owing a debt of about 3.5 million Naira for about two years now. Then the thing became a burden to me. And I keep on presenting it before God. And by God's grace, I do come out for pledge whenever Daddy Gio calls out for pledge in any program. And I make sure I redeem my own pledge instantly. So this last uh, program, so to Joy. I, I'm, by God's grace, I'm a businessman. I'm into plumbing and building materials. So this last, uh, so to Joy, uh, Gio mentioned a particular case. He said, you that have goods, and you cannot sell it. I command that goods to be sold. Yes. We if you can remember. Yes, we had that. Word of I happen to have uh, thousands of pieces of goods in store that I struggle to sell. But after that program, the last day of that struggle to joy, I was opportune to meet our daddy in the Lord, and he, and he placed his finger on my forehead, and he said, you are blessed. Mm. And I claimed that prayer. And I went home with joy. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Getting home on that Sunday, on the Monday morning, calls started coming in. Hey. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Before you know, calls from different angle, and I was able to sell every goose under a week. Wow. Hey. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And after selling this good, I made millions of Naira profits, and I was able to clear that debt of 3.5 million. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Not uh, too long, last week, another goose was uh, chipped in into the country, and that was how they rushed everything, and that one finished again. Chosen, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Just after that encounter with my daddy in the Lord, it has been blessings from all angles. I want to use this opportunity to appreciate the God of choosing who has made this possible in my life. I say his name alone be highly exalted. Amen. And I pray for our daddy in the Do Lord. Do you mind if I ask you to refresh us with that testimony of how God connected you to a multi-million Naira company or contract or business? Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Uh, by God's grace, I happen to be the only child of my f parents, and I stayed with my uncle for nine good years. But after staying with him, he did not give me anything. So in the year 2014, I moved down to Lagos State. Then I was living an attachment with my mom's sister. We are about nine people in two rooms. So that is how we continued our life. Then I, every night, I keep on crying, praying to God that this is not how my life is going to be. Then the year 2020, during the lockdown, I always love uh, sowing seed in the house of God. Whenever they pay me salary, I share the salary into two, and I give God one. Hmm. Children, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So in the year uh, 2021, God of Jesus started his work. And I was opportune to be connected to a Chinese company. I did not have one Naira in my account. Hmm. But the spirit pushed me, said, go and print a company card. Then I used the last card in my hand. I did the company card. So when I got to that company, uh, this Chinese man requested for my company ID card. So when they gave him the ID card, he said, open the gate for him to come in. Hmm. Hey, hey. She's in praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So when I met the, the boss in question, he asked me my age. I told him, he said, young man, I want to make you rich. Hey, God of choosing, God of power. Hey, hey. She's in praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So brethren, that is how the journey began. 
I was looking at money, money was looking at me. Hmm. <laughs> but no, no physical cash to purchase those goods. I started calling family members for assistance. Everybody turned me down. Chisin, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I went back to God of Chisin. I said, you are the one that gave me this connection. And I know what you have started, you will perfect it. I, ha I have to borrow the sum of 40,000 naira from a friend of mine. I went down to the company. I bought one piece of the goose. I went inside the market. I started uh, doing marketing. So by God's grace, a particular man in the market, so he was afraid. He said that he cannot give me the money because he did not know me, that I might run away with his money. I said, no, sir, you can give me a try. He said, okay, I should drop my account number. Getting home that morning, I, I told God, if you will give me this, uh, if you will touch this man to buy this good from me, I will give you so, so, so amount from my first income. Then I left the battle for God. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Waking home that morning, it was an alert that woke me up. Hey. Choosing praise the Lord. Alert of how much? I, I got the alert of five million naira. Choosing say, praise the Lord. Say that again. I didn't get it. You got the alert of how much? I got the first alert of five million naira. Hey. Not a uh, few seconds later, the man called me on phone by himself. He said, Ifani, have you seen the alert? I said, yes, sir. He said, come to my shop. Rush, I quickly took my bath. I rushed down to the shop. He wrote a check of three million naira and gave to me. In addition. In addition to power, it. Power, clap on to <laughs> God of choosing, God of power. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So by God's grace, I was able to purchase some goods. And I made sure I supplied the goods to him. And that was my first time of making my first 350,000 profit cash. Then I looked at heaven. I said, God, is this how profitable business is? Mm. And I so paid my tithe and I sold seed out of it. God started giving me blessings. Sometimes in a single supply, I make the sum of 600,000 naira in one supply. Hey. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This is how it has been. And a multi-billionaire inside the market saw what God has started doing in my life. He summoned me to his office. He said, young man, I heard you are the one uh, supplying these goods. I said, yes, sir. He said, okay, I want to reach an agreement with you. I said, sir, what agreement? He said, I want you to take me to that company. I want to have a conversation with the white people. Then I will be giving you uh, discount of 200 naira per each goose. Then I looked at the man and I laughed. He's a well-respected man in the market. Then I said, sir, I did not leave my father's house. I crossed Onisha Bridge down to Lagos State just to collect 200 naira. <laughs> Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Even though I don't have the money to do the business, I know God will do something. Then I walked out of his office. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It became a battle. The man, I don't know how he got the contact of the people. He went down to the company. His, uh, his purpose was to reach the agreement, to seal everything so that he will be the only one supplying the goods in the market. So by God's grace, I was in, on, it was on Thursday service. I was here in the church. I prayed a particular prayer. Just after the service, the white man himself called me on phone. He said, Michael, do you know about Susu -so person? I said, yes, I know him. He said, as I speak with you now, he's in my office. <laughs> I said, how come? He said, don't worry, I know how to handle it. Hey! God don't choose him. God don't choose him. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So I went down on my knees here in the church. I said, God. Do not allow me to be put to shame. After that program, I quickly took bike. I rushed down to the company. Then when the white man saw me, he said that his purpose was to close the, the deal. But he disappointed him. Power! <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Thank you, Father. Jesus, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So by God's grace, that is how my testimony has started all since 2021. 
down to this year. And by the special grace of God, you will hear more of the testimonies. Amen. Choosing, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to use this opportunity to appreciate the God of choosing. Thank you, Who has made this possible in my life. Thank you, Lord. I say, may his name alone be highly exalted. I pray for our dad in the Lord, that the Lord will continue to give him the fortitude, continue to give him the grace to carry out this work without end in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. For the family at large, heaven at last, all the chosen members all over the world, heaven at last. Chosen is blessed. Clap unto God of the chosen. Clap unto him. Be a chosen. Obey all the teachings and instructions of the pastor of chosen. You will go very high, highest. But always listen to the beef in the testimony. We heard him. He said when he started working, whenever they paid him salary, how much did he say he was giving to God? He said he was dividing it into two and paying to God half, which is 50% tight. That's a very big one. And then God has moved. And then is now making him a very prosperous person. Be a choosing, pay your tithe, obey the words of the pastor of chosen. <laughs>